It's been amazing how that teacher connected you guys and that became the springboard for the rest of your life. Oh, absolutely. Sheila Spicer uh, was an extraordinary, it was an extraordinary educator. She's retired now, uh, is an extraordinary woman. She, uh, you know, one day I, I met uh, Brad Meltzer, uh, the, the renowned author and TV host. Um, he actually has Seth's haircut. Uh, and he, um, he uh, lived in, in like similar neighborhoods. He's a little bit older than I am, but uh, grew up in that neighborhood. And he tells a story um, I think he wrote about it in one of his books. Um, he was uh, went into creative writing class, I think, at NMB, at North Miami Beach Senior High School. Go Chargers. And he uh, goes into this creative writing class. And on day one, the teacher tells the class, I want you to do this sample kind of essay so I can get a feel for your skill level and everything. So everybody turns in this essay. The next day he comes in, she hands the papers back and she, she says something to him or writes it on the paper like, stay after class today. So he's concerned that maybe he's in trouble or he needs some remedial <laughs> courses or who knows what. So the teacher says to him, listen, you have a natural talent. You have a gift. I want you to spend the, this entire year sitting in the back of the room, not listening to a single word I say. Because yeah, I, mean, I don't, I don't want to do anything to tamper with what I think is your natural gift. You have to do all the homework because I got to grade you, but don't <laughs> listen to what I'm teaching. You do you, do your own thing. That is why he is a best-selling author today. And that woman was Sheila Spicer, was the same teacher who later in life went on to teach drama and TV production at Highland Oaks Middle and put Alfred and I together. So this is an extraordinary woman who who, who changed the lives of a lot of the students that she came uh, into contact with. Um, the only thing more inspiring than a good teacher is a bad teacher, but, share, but which I also had my fair share of in the Dade County Public Schools, mind you. But uh, Sheila Spicer was not one of the good ones. She was one of the, the extraordinary ones. She was one of the special ones that just, that, that, that changes people's lives. Big salute to Sheila Spicer. Good story.